All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem Yahusha, by Hashem Rakhodash, by Kathom. Double honors, God, um, uh, double honors to the apostles and the elders. A great millstone, the Ruel, and a salute and a Shalom to all the Akim that are out here laboring, pushing this truth in all sincerity and in truth. Right. I don't know how long it's gonna be, but we'll see. Let's get into it. This is from the brother uh uh Yashawamba. Uh his his uh channel, uh, Remnant Saved 144. Subscribe and be edified. Let's get it. A lot of you have been such fools for the idea of the microchip being the mark of the beast. You've been such so blind to it. You were so easily fooled. All somebody had to do is say the microchip is the way you get the, is it's how you get the mark of the beast. You put that chip in you, that's your forehead in your hand. It's ridiculous, man. It is absolutely the ridiculous. You think God cares that you put a microchip in your body? You think God cares that you put a microchip in your body? You think God cares? You think God cares? You think God cares? You think God cares? You got a microchip on your phone, a microchip in everything that you have has a microchip. Because I know I got Yahweh you know, behind. came out with it. All right. So, y'all heard y'all heard what he said, man. <laughs> y'all heard what he said. Y'all heard the stupid ass shit he said out his fucking mouth. Now, real quick. Now, he's saying that we're blind because we believe and we know that the uh, RFID chip is the mark of the beast. He's saying we're stupid, basically, that we're blind for believing that and for knowing that. Well, let's get it real quick. Let's get this. Let's get Daniel first. Because General Yohanna, he's of the wicked that won't understand. This is uh, Daniel 12 to 10. It says, Many shall be purified and made white and tried, but the wicked shall do wickedly, and none of the wicked shall understand, but the wise shall understand. All right? So, Yohanna, he's of the wicked. He don't understand, man. Okay? He don't understand. That's why he's constantly scoffing at the truth that the uh, or 5D chip is the mark of the beast. Okay? He don't get it. He don't understand how it can be the mark of the beast. Alright? Let's get this. Okay? This is uh All right, Proverbs 13 and 16 it says every prudent man dealeth with knowledge but a fool layeth open his folly. Yahana of IJBK he is a goddamn fool man. He is a fool man. Right? And he laid open his folly man. Right? The dumb shit that came out of his mouth, mouth, man. He laid it open, man. Proverbs 14 and 8. The wisdom of, of the prudent is to understand his way. But the folly of fools is deceit. Mm. Uh, Proverbs 14 and 15. The simple believeth every word, but the prudent man looketh well to his goings. Right now, evidently, Yahana he didn't look well to his goings, man. Okay, he don't he he didn't look well to his goings, man. So 
He's simple. He is simple. Okay, because he was saying it, saying at first that the mark of the beast is sleeping with white women. Then he said it's your Christianity. Now he's saying that everything you got is the mark of the beast or has the mark of the beast. So he's what? Double-minded, right? This is a James 1 and 8. It says, a double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. See? So when you are unstable... You don't know what to believe. You're confused. Okay? You are confused. Okay? So, Yohanna of IJPK, he is double-minded. He is unstable. He is confused. He don't know what to believe. Okay? James 4 and 8. Draw nigh to Yahweh, and he will draw nigh to you. Cleanse your hands, ye sinners. Now, Yohanna has a lot of blood on his hands. He didn't cleanse his hands, man. He didn't cleanse his hands, man. He has blood on his hands. Because he's not teaching his congregation the truth, man. He's coming with nonsense. He's coming with folly. It says, and purify your hearts, your minds. Right? So, Yohanna's mind has not been cleansed. His mind has not been washed. His brain has not been washed. His brain is filthy and is dirty. Ye double-minded. See? Now, let's get Revelation. And I'm going to get the last thing he said too. All right. Revelation 13 and 16, it says, and he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Okay? Now, what does it say, save he, right? It says, and that no man might buy or sell, save he, basically except he, that has the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Now, I remember years ago, right? This had to be probably like four years ago, right? Um, Deacon Haka of Sakari, him and uh, him and uh, and uh, and uh, uh, Alize. Of Sakari, right? They said, uh, well, yeah. Uh, they they did a video, and Deacon Haka of Sakari, he mentioned what General Yohanna said. Okay, he said that that he would take the chip, and that Deacon Haka will take the chip. Why? Because he wants to eat. And Yohanna, he can't say he didn't say that because he said it. Because I seen a video. I seen a video, man. I seen the damn video. So so Yahana, you can't lie, man. You can you cannot lie about that, man. You said the shit, man. They came out of your damn mouth, man. Okay? Now the word word for mark in the Greek. Is what? Haragma, right? Haragma. It says what? A stamp. In, an imprinted mark. An imprinted mark. Now, I don't know if they still brand horses or not, but back in the day, they would brand horses. Okay? 
so 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 if the horse got lost right the person that found the horse would know who the horse belongs to okay it says thing carved sculpture graven work of idolatrous uh, 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 images right it says here a scratch or itching stamp as a badge of servitude so if you receive the mark of the beast the RFID chip that's your badge of slavery that's your badge of servitude okay it's not difficult man it's not difficult okay because the RFID chip, that would be the new currency, all right? The new currency will be what? Digital, okay? You won't be able to use cash anymore. Right? You won't be able to use uh, 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 cash. You won't, you won't be able to use uh, debit cards nor credit cards. You won't be able to use no cash app no more. No PayPal. Okay? No Apple Pay. No Google Pay. Okay? No Venmo. You, you won't be able to use them. Why? Because the currency will be digital. Okay? All of your money will be on that chip. Okay? Your medical records and all that. Okay? All right? So when you go to the store... Right, and you want to purchase some some groceries or something for your house. All right, all you will have to do is wave your hand, okay, across the scanner, and it will scan. Right, or you will have to have to uh, 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 have to get your forehead scanned. So you will be able to purchase groceries or whatever you want from the store, right? So if you want those, those want those new uh, Jordans, want those new Jays, you will have to get the RFID chip in order to get that. Okay, it says, see, it says, if weather, see, now, you serious? Come on, man. All right, uh, okay, hmm. And no man my Lord sell save you there the mark or the name of the beast kind. It says uh and no man my buy or sell. Buy or sell. Buy, alright. It says buy. What's that in the Greek? Let's see what buy means. Strong's G fifty nine, Agarazzo, Agarazzo. All right. It says this: to be in the marketplace, to attend it, right? To do business there, buy or sell. Okay. Now, what do you do in a marketplace? You go to a marketplace to do what? To buy what? Clothes and food. Right, man? You do that to buy clothes and food. All right, so there would be no other reason for anyone to be in the grocery store or in the marketplace if they're not buying anything. Okay? It says this, to purchase. You go to a marketplace to 
purchase something, right? Now, if you go to the grocery store, but you don't have any money, can you buy anything? No, you cannot. So, if you don't have the chip, right? If you don't receive the mark of the beast, guess what? You won't be able to buy or sell anything. Okay? Now, Right now, I believe Johanna said this too. It was either Johanna or Nate. One of them said it's an embargo. First of all, an embargo, it stops you from buying or selling. So it's not an embargo. Okay. The mark of the beast, which is the RFID chip, it allows you to buy and sell. All right. Now, Johanna said, he said, does God care if you, uh, if you receive the mark of the beast or something like that? Hold on. Let, let's see. Let's see real quick. Let's see. Here it is. He's, he's okay. It says, does God care if you take the chip? Hold on. Let's see real quick. Everything that you have has a microphone. Because I know I got Yahweh behind. They came out with it. Oh. Cares. You think God cares? You think God cares? You got a microchip on your phone, a microchip in. So he said, does God care if you take the chip? Does God care if you take the chip? Well, Johanna, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what the scriptures say. Because, hey, uh, Johanna, I don't know if you know this, but John, the revelator, he wrote the book of Revelation. So I'm going with what the scriptures say. Revelation 14 and 9 to 11. It says, And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast in his image, and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand. So it don't matter where you get it. If you take it, you will be destroyed. It says, The same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh, which is poured out without mixture to the cup of his indignation. And he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. And the smoke of their torment ascendeth up forever. They shall have no rest day nor night. Who worship the beast in his image. And whosoever receiveth the mark of his name. So, if you receive the mark of the beast, the RFID chip, you will be destroyed. So, Johanna, does God care if you receive the chip? Yes, he does. Right, Johanna? So, you can read Revelation 14 and 9 to 11. And I know you can read, Yana. I know you can read. Read, man. I know you can read. You can't be that foolish. You can't be that stupid, man. You cannot be that stupid. Let's get this. This is Matthew 15 and 14. It says, let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. 
And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. So IHBK, they are false prophets. Especially Yohanna. Okay? And, and, uh, and, and, uh, uh, Tazariak, and Hatazah. They're false prophets. They said, what? Well, Jacob's trouble is gay. Come on now, man. So, the blind is leading the blind. And now as you became, they are blind. They don't know what they're involved in. They don't know what's about to happen. All right? But we have the ice out, though. Let me get that. I should know how to spell it. Ice out. Oh, okay. It's one word then. Okay. Revelation 3 and 18. It says, I counsel thee to buy of me gold tried in the fire that thou mayest be rich and white raiment that thou mayest be kind uh, that thou mayest be clothed and that the shame of thy nakedness do not appear and anoint thine eyes with eye salve that thou mayest see okay we have the eye salve so we can see, all right? We can see what the mark of the beast is. We know it is the chip. That's clear as day. All right? Now, the first of 2020, all right? The first, uh, no, the second month of 2020. Right. Me, my cousin, and her, uh, her daughter, and her niece, we were going down to Indianapolis, right, to see my daughter, right. And my cousin said, she said, they want to put a chip in you, right. I said. Yeah they, yeah, they want to put a chip in everybody. She, she said, why in the fuck would I take a chip? She, she said that. She said, why the fuck would I take the chip? I don't want nothing inside of me like that. I don't want nothing like that inside of me. I'm not taking no damn chip. And she's in the Christian church. And she's in the Christian church, man. And she even knows that the R5D chip is the mark of the beast. She even knows that. But you have this guy here, though. But you have him. The one on the screen, Yohanna. You have him that don't know what it is. He's confused. How is it that a lot of these Christians, uh, that a lot of these so-called Christians know what the mark of the beast is, but Yohanna don't know. That don't make no sense to me. But hey, but hey, what do, but hey though man, but what do I know though? I'm just a humble servant of Yahweh by Shemel So with that, I say Shalom, all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Kakadash, Bakatam. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, they were well. And a salute and a shalom to all the Akim that are out here laboring and pushing this truth in all sincerity and the truth. And with that, I say shalom.